One of the things we want to keep in mind is that light travels in waves. So the ship is not making its own light. So what's happening is the light's coming from the sun, it's hitting the ship, and it's reflecting towards our eyes. But what happens is, is you've got this layer of really cool, dense air that's right on the ocean, and above it you have warmer, less dense air. So the inferior mirage is the, the classic one we think when we think of like a Western movie or on a really, really hot summer day, you look at the road and you can see it kind of wavy. Or if you've seen movies where there's somebody walking in the desert and they see water and what they're seeing is kind of the sky, the blue sky reflecting down. This is where you'll see an almost like a mirror image of something. So like if you had a ship out on the ocean, you might see the, the, the ship in its regular position, but you might see another ship that's in the inverse above it. When you take a picture, it's capturing exactly what our eyes are seeing as well. So it's just graphing the light that it sees standing where we are for the photograph.